Hey, how's it going? George Sanchez here at EJ Homes, one of the senior agents here. And today I have the pleasure of interviewing our president, Ruben Hernandez. Ruben, how are you doing today? Good. I'll go bump. I got it. Like yeah, we got to, you know, <laughs> still keep it safe, safe distancing. We got our masks here. We got to be safe here at, at the office. Ruben, um, just wanted to ask you a couple of questions so we could know a little bit more about EGA. Sure. sure. And for some of those people that are out there asking, what is EGA? Who is EGA? And, you know, agents that are thinking of coming on to our our to our company so they can know a little bit more about who we are, who you are, and what the company stands for. Sure. Uh, so one of the questions, Ruben, is uh, what are the differences and similarities that you see between the military that the, where, where you served and the years you were there mm -hmm. to the real estate business? Yeah, absolutely. Great question. So first off, thank you for your time. I really appreciate it. Uh, so, you know, having served in the Marine Corps for, you know, several years and also having served in different military campaigns like Desert Storm, for example, um, fundamentally, you know, we work collaboratively, we work as a team. And, you know, the culture that we have here at EGA Homes is something where we look out for one another. We want to make sure that the mission gets accomplished, whether it's helping consumers buy or sell. Uh, but ultimately, it's also a family where we help each other succeed. And we really want to help each other uh, develop a legacy that we can leave for next generation. So they also have an opportunity to take advantage of real estate opportunities as they as they come up as well. So um, that's the overall big picture. Uh, the correlation to the military is obviously, you know, teamwork, collaboration, integrity, um, working as as one unit to help our consumers achieve the goals and objectives that they set. And that leads us to the next question. So having that culture, having that model, uh, like the, the military model, the, the Marine model, how does that make it for better business? How do uh, agents flourish with this type of environment? Yeah, so that's something, you know, the Marine Corps is uh, is something that having enlisted at a very young age, um, you know, they mold us into a certain type of an individual, you know, and even though this is obviously not Marine Corps owned, it's a civilian owned, I'm a civilian now, uh, but that mindset that I developed in the Marine Corps will always um, stay with me. And so um, we transition that over to the agents. Most of the agents here are not, um, you not never served in the military, but they share that mindset of collaboration, mission accomplishment, um, working as one unit. Um, I have not seen any big egos here. I have not seen, um, you know, a fraternity. It's really been about what's going to help you be successful, what's going to help the consumer, the customer be successful as well. I hope that answered your question. No, no, yeah, yeah. And, and what type of relationship do you strive to have with each individual agent? Yeah, so the relationships are, are critical. You know, I think first and foremost, uh, the leaders that I served with in the Marine Corps, you know, in war and in peacetime, um, they were in the trenches. You know, we could always uh, go to them. You could, We knew that they had our backs. They knew that they were watching our six, to use a military term. And um, that confidence uh, built respect. It built credibility. It motivated us. It, it, it was amazing. In the Marine Corps, we call it esprit de corps. Um, but, in you know, in the civilian world, it's the same principle. It's... You know, you look up to your leaders and you want them to lead from the front to make sure that they're doing things in an integrous manner on a daily basis. And they're in the trenches with you, not just, you know, somewhere else, you know, watching you do the work. You know, I love being in the trenches and it's resonated with um, with the EGA agents to, so that they know that we have their backs and that we're continuing to lead from the front now and well into the future as the market becomes more competitive. 